Look. If you had one shot, or one opportunity, to seize everything you ever wanted, in one moment, would you capture, or just let it slip? Yo. My name is Danielle Trada. Williams. I'm Marcelo. Dodic Girardi. Aria DiStefano. I'm Benjamin Handel. It's a process. We learn how to do um, virtual simulations, and we learn all the aspects that go into creating a game. Well, we learn the theory behind games then. The very concept thoughts of making it. Just like if you're baking a cake. It shows the creativity that you can take any simple idea and convert it into a game or a simulation. So the enjoyment level will be pretty high. To the actual engineering a game. And even then, you know, you're going to have some good cakes and bad cakes. That's basically it. different roles throughout the whole project but at this point in time doing the uh, virtual world I'm just the cataloger I just keep track of everything that's going to be going into this Project is a first-person RPG a game that will allow uh, students to explore Sullivan before they actually attend Sullivan. It's basically simulating your first semester at a college.
flavor fight. What a lot of people don't understand with the whole game design degree is that it's not just you go into class and then boom, you just start making games. It's such a long process because there's so many things the school has. From chairs, buildings, computer, or tables, even the uh, interior design of it. Some of them are researching objects on the internet, and some of them could be creating objects in a 3D modeling program if we can't find them anywhere else. Where I'm taking the aspects of objects that would be in the real world and make it into the virtual. It's a, it's a really fun experience. I mean, this is something we're making, you know? Um, we're learning how to create and we're actually doing it. And it's going to have a higher purpose. So it's, it's a lot of fun and there's a lot of learning involved. Every brick in the school is counted. Thank you.